We need to be them. We need to be them. I got y'all. I already bet it on y'all. I got this boy to be right. Just came straight back with man. I bet it. I bet it. Cause y'all defense is so cold. I said, I bet it. I said, they ain't gonna lose. He was saying, man, I don't think, I don't think they gonna do it. Oh, they got the coach back too? Yeah. They barely beat Georgia. They beat Georgia. To me, they cheated. Yeah. Georgia was beating Georgia. Neither is Alabama. Yeah, that too. He said, Alabama's not like they used to be. They ain't like they was. No, no. I don't know. Alabama used to be the team to beat. This year, it's not like that. Like, they defense good, and like, they offense okay, just stay like quarterback throw. Right. But you know. They're in their rebuild. Yeah. You're going to play like they that, though. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to play like they that, that, though. Yeah, we got to play like that. <laughs> <laughs> I remember we were just talking. I forget his name. It was the first person we talked to. Uh, Hello? Yeah, yeah. He was like, he was like, you can't you can't underestimate like yeah. the opponent. Like, Because anything could happen. Yeah. Anything could happen. Anything can happen. And y'all got the computer finished? Ah, cool. Yeah. Okay. Right. Main question was at 52. Where you get it from? 52. And why do you want 52? Basically, I had 53 in high school, and I just said like 53. Yeah. It was just the next number for us, so. What's better than 52? You gonna just know like number one and like number I mean, I want to number, that that. number four in high school, but I have a senior season, so I ain't get four. Mm. What's, what's up with four? Four, I just like four, four. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we was on the we was on the gram, and your first person on the gram is uh, it's your grandmother. Like she passed, rest in peace. Yeah. Um, I just really want to know, like, is your grandmother? Did she impact your career? Today, like, does she? How does she uh, motivate you to to be who you are, the person you are? I mean, everything I do is for my grandmother, and my family, for real. So she's always with me. Love her. Of course, of course, of course. Um. Okay, so I was also I was also looking through your discography. You got a lot of. First of all, they say you the one. <laughs> they say you you're not the one. You're not like you're not the two. You're not the three. You're the one. Like you, like as yo, your the energy we was before you came in was like waiting for that dude. I want to know how. I do, man. I just. I do. I want to know, like, what was like, what work went into that precisely, like the the momentum. Like, how did you? I know it's your junior year. Usually, people don't. Like, is there, I bet there's probably, you, you answered this question for me. Is there many people at their senior year that's been doing this longer than you that you feel like you're not even better than that you like just more accoladed at? I mean, yeah, you always gotta have confidence in stuff, so. <laughs> I mean, I do think I'm better than other people, but I just gotta prove on the field for them, show the coaching so I can do it and we need to do it more. All right, so let's say I'm comparing you to Drake as of now. <laughs> you the Drake of the, of the football, you of them football as of now. Um, so what I think, at least, at least I watched a recent interview with Drake, and he was like, he thinks that like Kiki D Love be put into like that that next level. Is there a certain moment that solidified your career? Like, yeah, I'm that. I mean, every day is an opportunity for us. So anytime you touch the field, especially game days, like. Just a chance of showing them. So if you do your thing, you do your thing. Mm. Mm. But there was no you don't you don't think there was ever like Not a specific yet. moment. Not yet. Not yet. Not yet. I know you play. I you're doing the research. I know you play Edge. Yeah. Is first of all, explain what Edge is to me. I have no I have no idea. So basically, we defensive end. I'm the last person on the D line. I'm trying basically trying to get the quarterback. <clears throat> That's like my main focus. To get the quarterback in the side, especially when you're passing the ball, is basically being able to stop the run and don't let anything go outside of me. Mm. Then at times I drop the coverage, yeah. Okay. Is that your preferred like position to play? Yeah. Yeah, preferred edge? Yeah. Uh has it always been, even in high school? 
so I played running back, linebacker in little, little League. And then high school, I played linebacker two years. Then they moved me to edge. No, I played linebacker one year, then they moved me to edge. So I only really played edge for two years before coming to college. Okay. Okay. I know it, first and foremost, I know it takes time and like, right, persistence to be like, act like, to be acknowledged the way you are as of now. How does it differ from like high school? People say like coming into like college football from high school, it's like, wow, I'm like, it's a, the competition is there. Yeah. Is there any point in time, like, like I want to know your growth, your story, like how, like how did you work your way up to being at this point? So high school and college is different because high school you could be the man, but then when you come to college, everybody's good. Mm. So now it's just like the little things, like being able to do the technique right, stuff like that is going to get you to like where you want to be. And um, yeah, what, what else you said? I just, what? The Tell work that you put in. How you got from being a high school, uh, football player to a college football player, and what did you do to get that to better yourself? Like so I'm not even So from <laughs> college, basically, you just gotta have the work ethic. And like, for my story is like, I come from a small state, Connecticut. Like nobody really knows what Connecticut is. So like, you gotta be like that guy for. Real. Which in my day I was going up there and coming out of high school in my state. I was like top 20 in a, in a little region. I was damn near, yeah, damn near 300 on ESPN. And then when you come to college, like you just probably just gotta work. Everything is just working, grinding, like it really makes the guy. Because everybody thinks it's good to NFL, like, only 1% gets to the NFL. So, so we gotta have like something different or like, Something unique about you. So is that like first one there, last one out situation? Yeah. Like when you the first one to get in practice, the last one to leave practice. <laughs> in high school, in high school, it was really working out and doing good, like getting better at football. So is there a big like football scene? You really got to just uh, just run by yourself. Cause the hardest time to like really work on something is by yourself. But like, if you could do that, then like, just got it. Who taught you how to? Who taught you how to work with it? Who you think you got that? My dad. Since I was young, my dad like had me working on stuff. Put me in math, sports, football, baseball, basketball, soccer. Always doing something. Yeah. Stay in condition. Just keeping us busy. Yeah. Do you run a lot? Yeah, I used to run track. So yeah. What you what you what did you run the track? I did a one, two, I just shot a discus. So you very versatile? Yeah. And you think that helped you? Yeah. I feel like every sport I played, like really played in like high school, like middle school to high school, it helped me to come here. It's everything like you know, it like Kind of goes with football, right? You can put that to football, whatever sport. Are you? Uh, I ask this often. Are you planning on going to the NFL? Yeah, that's my dream right now. But you know, short. I'm trying to get the degree too. Exactly. Uh, economic major. Okay. Economic major. What made you want to choose economics? I like numbers, I like what's going money, so yeah. Beautiful. Beautiful. Like, so you went into, first of all, when you came from high school to college, did you know you were going to play football? Yeah. So, being like, wanted to do economics, where did that come from? So, like, I know like, you have to do academics. I always did, like, my schoolwork. Like, since I was little, my parents had to do my schoolwork, so. So like high school, school was pretty easy. Came pretty easy. In college, it's like more like self motivating yourself, like really doing your work. And then like I tried to get into business to the law school, but like freshman year I had a couple like mess ups, so that kind of like mess up, not mess everything up, but it's just like 
made me go to economics. You trying to be a lawyer? No, I'm trying to be a uh, business. But they all like, economics, like, overall, like, it works for, like, everything. So, the business school at U of M, it's Ross, right? No, I'm at LSA now. I was grinding against Ross. Mm. So, what, I, I know you said you, like, like, why didn't you, like, why, why wasn't that, why, why didn't you, why do you think you didn't get there? I was just a mature freshman here, you know, young. Yeah. Huh. So, you, you enjoy the economics now? Yeah. So what is like what what's so outside of numbers? I know you said numbers. Like, do you want like what do you want to use economics for? Anything for you know, that could be personal counsel. I could work with like big businesses. You know, work with the government if I really want to. All types. You do a lot of economics. I don't really got anything for right now. It's not really deep into it yet. Mm -hmm. But we still want to still chase that dream. So. Yeah, find the economics standard plan B. Plan B, exactly, exactly. Do you plan on getting your CPA license? What's that? It's a sort of. It's a basically your being an accountant. Um, I mean, we'll see. I don't really know right now. Okay. Uh, you got anything like? Uh, you got any beers on it? Beers? Not yeah. really. No beer. Not really. Don't put good day. Huh? Say no beer. So you do it in your spare time, like for hobby, besides playing football. Watching TV. Like movies? Like, yeah. I like, I like movies or like series. The genre uh, like the beat. Like series like Snowfall. Oh, okay. Snowfall, I love Snowfall. Snowfall stuff. I watch like all the 50 Cent shows, Power and stuff. That's you. Huh? That's you. Yeah. Huh? Um. <laughs> do you count your locks? Yeah. I just, just kind of coming off of their conversation. Do you count your locks? How many locks do you got? I think I got like a hundred something, like one thirteen. One thirteen? Yeah. I don't know nothing about locks. Is that that's a high number? That is I, I probably got like three. <laughs> no. Okay. Okay. <laughs> uh. Do you get to go home that often? Uh, sometimes, not for real. We be in season all year, so. What's that called? Hmm? What's that called? Uh, my mom, my dad, my four siblings. Are you, are you the oldest? I'm the second. There's a, I got an older brother. Then it goes me, it goes my older brother, me, my sister, then I got a brother and another sister. I said, what is this? She played basketball or something? Yeah, that's the baby. Right. She might be like, she's like 5'10. Is she? Yeah. She, she's tall. I don't think she's like 11. I don't think she's tall. Can I ask what made you want to play football? What made you choose football? Uh, my dad. So you grew up playing football with your dad? Well, I, I was more of a gamer when I was younger. So like, I was really into sports. They kind of put me into it. And then like, because I was so big and like, Loki was like athletic. It was like, I, I kind of like it, especially when I was good at it. Mm -hmm. so, yeah. That's tough, that's tough. Hey, you going to be working on the show? So, was there any other thing that you that you like enjoyed outside of football? What I know football is like the dream, and you're like you're great at it. But is there anything else that like was football your solace, or was there anything else that like when football got a little bit too much that you uh, leaned on growing up? It was just more football, and like ain't really like much problems with football. It's more like eventual teams yeah. trying to be beat the mentally as well. Like, um, I know you said you have. I'm do apologize. Can you remind me where you're from? I'm from Connecticut. Connecticut. Was it Connecticut? Yeah. Um, how is that? Is that a long ways from here? Uh, yeah, an hour drive. Uh, I think so. 
Um, shoot, do you ever feel like homesick? Uh, yeah, bro. I mean, I like the independence, so that would make me not feel homesick. But like, you know, me not seeing my family much is like, damn, maybe want to go home because I don't see them often. Then you get tired of people there, so yeah. Yeah, you get tired of people. <laughs> <laughs> so that that brings me to what's the difference between here in Connecticut? Connecticut's small. Everybody kind of know everybody. Here is like, I don't know, street sun. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 The weather's just bipolar. Right. Yeah. Connecticut got four seasons, but I'm not bipolar. <laughs> I'm um, off the axe for food. Like, what's your favorite food? I like stewed chicken and rice. Stewed chicken and rice. Uh, is that like a traditional meal? Like your mom made? That sounds like a that sounds like a mom made Jamaican. Meal. Yeah. Jamaican? Are yeah. you Jamaican? Yeah, my dad's Jamaican. Oh, that's dope. That's dope. Right. It's... <laughs> that's dope. Um, did he like? Is was he like born Jamaican? Jamaica or like? Yeah, he born in Jamaica. Wow. When did he come over? He came over like. 10-11. Ah. Uh, do you think, like, is, I want to know what got your dad being Jamaican, like, what got your dad into, like, football? You ever ask him? I mean, I don't really know, to be honest. Yeah. It was just like, who gave me that? Guess one, I, think, I think it was one of his coaches, actually. Mm -hmm. I seen him in high school, uh, and it's just like, just come try out and just try to keep on the you know, right path for it. I like that. Um, often, when it comes to like sports, like that's like the bond, like like father son throwing, throwing the ball. Is there any, is, do you, do you remember learning how to play football or was it just like, like for as long as you could? Learn it. Learn it? Yeah, everything happened in the backyard. Girls, we just girls in the backyard. Uh, oh, I don't know. Like, we found some gaps over there. Um, you play like with your friends? I mean, yeah, we put on the same team and stuff, yeah. Uh, like, do you, back then, did you prefer, like, the that feel like just at home game, but like, well, I'm not saying at home. I mean like <laughs> at home <laughs> games or uh, the uh, like being at school on the field. Uh, I feel like more I like school. Yeah, yeah. So I feel like that's where I play my friends more. Too. That's where you play. Sorry, what? I play football with my friends more. Like, yeah. Mm. Especially like recent. Stuff like that. Yeah, I like the job. Uh, can I ask? No, I wouldn't know. So I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> what is a day of relaxation for you? Oh, me? Yeah, which is usually my Sundays. I'll probably wake up late, lay in the bed for a little minute, get some food. Watch TV over there, get full of it. So that is you just watch TV over here. Yeah, calm days. It's usually so we practice in the six six times a week, so but we on our feet, that's not really our only like day off our feet. No being like that. How much do you guys how often do you guys like weigh in? Every day. Every day? Yeah. Wow. Um, Did you say you know, uh, yeah, I lost weight last time. I was 260 last night. Really? Yeah, 260. I'll be, I'll be in the 250, 255 range. Is, what does that do to. Does that ever, like, how do you feel about that? Like weighing in every day? Does that ever affect you? I mean, it don't affect me. It's just like type of shit. Yeah, it just like work. Yeah. There's, it's a job, go there, work. Like you get your money. Yeah, and I often ask this, like it's the dichotomy between like the weird thing, of, like when your work is your passion, yeah, and I your passion is your work. Does it ever like does it ever affect anything the way you like your love for the game? Not for real, but you know, 
feel me? You gotta, if you wanna be good, you're gonna have to put work into your craft, mm-hmm. at your work, at your job, if you wanna get paid extra money, stuff like that, and that's what's gonna get you better. Really? What is the difference between, like, I, you're obviously, like, you're, you're seen, like, more seen now, and before, when you were playing just for entertainment, for the passion, like, what, how, what's the changes that you've seen? Probably just more of a business. So, you know, it's it's really next man up. If you get hurt, like, they don't really, I would say they don't, they don't care, but like, next man up for whoever is behind him, uh, it's uh, his time. And then, if he does good, you might lose your job. And if he doesn't do good, if he does do good, you feel me? They might still let you battle for it, they might take the job away. You gotta work for it, yeah. So it's more of a business. Like, in high school, it's more like, oh, if you're that guy, you know, that's your spot, blah, blah, blah. That's like, like, yeah. Does it ever affect like interactions with people, like inter- like meeting people? Nah, not for me. Maybe for like other people. So. Mm-hmm. I, that stuff needs to motivate me. If I'm like somebody better than me, I won't say nobody better than me, but like somebody in a better position than me, he is motivated. Yeah. I like that. <laughs> are you first like we you talk about this are you uh like interaction with women has like being who you are impact your interaction with women yeah it depends on the girl for real. yeah so like some women they like to play hard some women are like Fangirls. What is your type? Do you prefer a fangirl or do you like uh like what do you think be you like? What's I hold on, people probably wanna know. What's your type? (laughs) (laughs) They don't come flocking. You say you don't like fangirls? What is it? What is you say you like? Fangirls. You don't like fangirls. 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 So you wanna be like cloud chasing people's trash. So what is the the ideal, like paint the picture of the ideal woman? I mean, I only got a type who was good to me, was good to me, so that's what it is. If I like your personality and shit. Yeah, Yeah, it's a lot. I know y'all be having a are you ready for this Alabama game? Yeah. Let's talk about the game. 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 I got to play for y'all, boy. I said, then y'all ain't gonna let them scope. I feel like we're going to lock them. You know, not scary. We can't be doing on the work on the factory ball games. You know what I mean? Going over some confidence. Start game for Really? Yeah. 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 They're not better than us. They just you know, just their name, Bama. Like that's all people know them for. For the past, like athletes and stuff. They ain't really been doing too much. Like, like, I think like, just a couple of the past few years. So Michigan, especially with, like everybody gets us too. So it's like just like extra drive and everybody a little bit harder. So everybody wants to see us lose. We know that extra shit. Sure. Oh, that makes you want to even more, right? Yeah. 100%. Man, just say you put this whole check. That's that's a lot. A whole check? That's, like, expensive. <laughs> expensive. Wow. But that, doesn't that, like, motivate you more, though? Like, some, like, people wanting? They, like you just said, it's better to motivate you more. Haters motivate you. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. Hmm. Oh, you good. Dude, I'm so good. I'm so good. What's your favorite game with you? Hey, hold on. My bad. My bad. What's your favorite game this season?
designed to be. I said, I said, Penn State? Yeah. Why Penn State? Because it was the most challenging for our Yeah, I was going to say, that was a lot of hate. Did you like, was there like a. I won't say most challenging, I said like the most aggressive game we had. It was like a play? Was there a specific play that you remember? Uh, not for me, but my boy Kenneth Brent made me tackle with Chase Down on the West on a running back. Mm. So I was trying to touch down here. Yeah. You, honestly, because I'm like, before, before we just came in, like, I'm not. I'm not too much of like a, a football fan, but like meeting you guys, like meeting you specifically, it's like making me want to like see the game. <laughs> it's making me want to like the movie. Yeah. Because I feel like, first of all, first and foremost, it, everyone talks about football. It's like a thing. <laughs> it's like a thing. And like, me, like, I just, it, it's something that I miss. It's not even like I have reason not to like it. It's something that is going over my head. But it's, it's, it not only, well, first of all, a lot of people talk about when it comes to like football, a lot of people talk about like, yeah. it's basically you get paid off in the like, yeah, I mean, so like games, people want you to make commercials, they pay you, stuff like that. It's basically, you're basically in the NFL, basically. Right. Like, all the sponsorships and stuff, that's how you get paid off. So the sponsors and all the games and stuff. Too. Hey, babe, you up here? Nah, not yet. They got like JJ Blake and them. Uh, what brand would you go with? You go with Sprite, something like that, Adidas, Nike, or? Shit, whatever brand give me the most money. Man, you ain't got nobody like, nothing like lifestyle wise? I mean, I like Nike, yeah. If Nike's give me a, like, a little small shot, I'll take it. I like Sashi. Louis V. If you wasn't in the entertainment industry, any any nothing can be done in the entertainment industry. What would you do? Me. I don't really know. But like, yeah, I don't really know. I think like football, so I don't really like try to uh, you just do some basic like construction or something like that. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> like, I don't know. If I was to play football, should I try to do something? That's all the question. <laughs> hey, we're gonna do, we're gonna start doing it like that. If they can't answer it, you're gonna, you're gonna get a zip. <laughs> oh, messed up your line. We ain't got no shots or nothing like that. <laughs> we ain't got no shots. <laughs> <laughs> you know the game that you imagine playing for yourself? Outside of football, like, did you play any other game? If I play football, and there was other sport that I had to play, it's like you basketball. That's the thing. Like but I didn't really like basketball when I was younger though. Uh, you watch basketball today? No. No. I don't watch sports though. You don't watch like, I know you said you watch TV. Is that like the main, the main thing you do to relax? TV and video games. TV and video games. But like, there's more TV. I get on the games like, my friends get on the game. Design. Yeah, I'm trying to like, go so over there and shit. Let's get that barbershop talk. LeBron, MJ. LeBron, LeBron, LeBron Kobe. Kobe. I mean, shit. That's hard. Yeah. We'll make it hard. People say Kobe just because of like, his work ethic, bro. But like, LeBron, them, feel me? He done did dope shit, bro. Yeah. They got the most points in NBA all the time. Hmm. 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 Uh, I like the earrings. Where should we get your earrings? I got uh, my first earrings, I think, when I was younger. I think like with a baby fur, and then I got, I got the other ones in uh, eighth grade going to freshman year high school.
Not eighth grade. Like freshman, sophomore. Year, I <laughs> Um, I see you. I see you got the Crocs on. I love your Crocs. I think it goes most definitely goes with the amazing blue eye. Uh, do you have any? Uh, do you like you? You like Crocs? Is Crocs your thing? How do you feel about the uprising and Crocs these days? Yeah, they cool. They cool, I guess. I need to start wearing shoes more, but yeah, be honest. I see, I see, I see, I see you've been having a sports mode. Is that against the ground? <laughs> yeah, I don't put in a sports mode. I, I used to learn because they just eat it, bro. Thanks, I know we, we talk about, um, we talk about clothing. Do you ever think about the, I think, because obviously, okay, okay, all right, I'm going to future visioning. So, let's say NFL, right, you're on, Kobe, like Kobe level, and I don't know who's Kobe in football. Like, uh, what's that one dude? It's a white boy, Tom Brady. Tom Brady, you're on Tom Brady level, and you got you get a like, who's the first person you're going to for the the brand deal? Do we start talking about that? More than Nike, yeah, Nike. I feel like Nike is more like anybody get Nike for one of the bigger designers, is like. Yeah, they cool, but like, I feel like you get more money off Nike because it's more with everybody. Are you creating your own shoe? Yeah. Yeah, you creating your own shoe? Yeah, everything. Would you, would you, <laughs> would you? Okay. Just basically saying, if I wrote it down, what's your favorite color? Black. Black? Watch out. Just just natural. Yeah, black. Black is strong. Dominant color. Oh yeah, this one thing you talking about later too. Bro, am I crazy to think this? It's 30 old. No, 30 is old. 30 is old, okay. I'm not crazy to think it. 30 is old. 30 is old. You to the young folks know. Well, I respect you. Well, okay. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you know, I'm not crazy to think this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. I'm not crazy to think this. Five things you can bring to the band that's stranded out of it. Food, clothes, Wi Fi. Uh, shit. Uh, I don't know. I'm still Wi Fi person to that one. I think the next one gotta be like all my tech technology and like that. The Apple store or something like that. Touch it. <laughs> touch it, touch it, touch it. Touch it, touch it, touch it. Touch it. Oh, uh, which one do you think you want more? If you can only choose one, you either want fame or money. Money. Oh, okay. I'll let that touch it. Uh, fear or love? Yeah. Uh, Why so? I mean, why would you want to for Why would you want to spend your whole life? Hmm. Oh, like, oh, I say respect. Respect a lot. Uh, they respect. Mm -hmm. Why so? Because somebody can love you, but disrespect you at the same time. Thanks. No, it's the holiday time. We got a room. But uh, the holiday time, what you got planned out for the, uh, Christmas and uh, New Year? Uh, I might be going home for a couple of days and come back and then uh, go to LA to a game. And we'll be back soon. You know, we'll be Christmas. We gave us 23rd, so we should be football. When we come back, maybe 26th. And we have practice and we play on the first. <laughs> Uh, you got any reflections, uh, 2023? Reflections. Uh, don't get messy, Jenna. Just keep going. It's all you, you feel me? 
Can't nobody stop me from doing what you wanna do. And what about 2024? You got any, uh, what they call them? Goals. Goals. Yeah, what's, the, what's the R word? Resolution. Yeah, resolution. Yeah, resolution. You got the resolution for like things you like, uh, 2024. All right, I'm gonna be like, I got it. You got a plan? Really lock in the school and football. Just keep getting better day by day. That's my little thing. I just, I'll get better day by day. But me, I learn something every day, so. I already got my resolution this year. Design on the beat. Me, uh, go back home. Where are you going back uh, home? Yeah, I don't care. Not home. Uh, home, home in the apartment. Oh. Um, uh, shoot. Probably going to sleep early. Maybe I'll go home. That should have been a fish. Hey bro, I ain't gonna lie. So look, you thinking about going back to goddamn college? So then, boom. Is it is it is that first freshman year? Is it that worth it? Is it that worth it? Think going back for that? Yes and no. I feel like you live and learn. So I feel like I'll go back because you know life will be easier if I like did my thing. But then I want to go back because it's like nah, because like we already doing what the fuck we doing. So yeah. it's like you know what I mean. So we just gonna go back, just go back, just some fun shit. <laughs> also, 22 Jump Street type shit. I ain't gonna hold you. <laughs> also, 22 Jump Street. We just thinking about going to Washington, but Washington ain't got no dorms or nothing like that. We just gonna eat me. A lot of people watching watching Washington be in Arbor, though. Yeah, yeah. man. You went to the Let's go to EMU. EMU, though. Nah, not yet. Because that'd be some slash shit. Eastern be lit, too. Eastern? That'd be some slash stuff. Slash stuff. I do. So, you want to make that? Uh, how'd you grow up? Did you grow up like wealthy? Or, like, did you middle class or how'd you grow up like that? Middle class. Mm, for sure. Okay. How do you feel about the. Obviously, I I don't know. People who. who I'm not saying. I'm gonna talk about the, the rise and grind mentality. Obviously it helps you. Obviously it helps you for what you are and what you do in life. Yeah. But people who, who are looking to grow, um, what would your suggestions be? Um, go slow or go full out? Yeah. Take your time for it. Hmm. I think I need to start asking everybody this. Yeah. How'd you meet Picasso? Appreciate it. I really want to start asking everybody this. How you meet Picasso? Uh, it was off the app, the the cut app. Yeah, I met him at his first shop. I was getting cut by him, and then like, hey, I was what? I think the first one in here too. Yeah. Yeah. What made you want to stay with him? Good barber. I fucked with the cut. He gave me a good sweet. Cool. You got like a favorite all-time list? I think you said you did. Movies are cool, yo. I like TV. Top TV things? Yeah. I like Snowfall, Peaky Blinders. Hey, you miss a Peaky Blinders? Yeah, there's a <laughs> show on Netflix called Wentworth. What's it called? Wentworth. Is it good? Yeah, it's like some, it's like some uh, women gel and like, basically like, yeah, women gel, damn it. It's a lot, it's a lot of fun. Like Orange is the New Black? More serious though, way more serious. Wait, it's wait, called Wentworth, I've seen it. Yeah, Wentworth. It's like in Australia. Right. Oh, check it out. It's on Netflix? Yeah. The Decent Show, Powers. You went to the anime? Not for real. I don't watch anime. You sure? No, I'm sure. <laughs> nah, it's a lot of secret anime nerds out here. They be like secretive about it. They be like, oh, no, nah, I don't want to say I do it. I watch it. So you ain't never seen Dragon Ball Z? You don't know what I'm doing when I do this? I know what Dragon Ball Z is, but I ain't watching it. <laughs> okay, 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 you know. Goddamn, you know. <laughs> I gotta do that shit like goofy, goofy. Anime. <laughs> uh, TV shows you watch growing up? Me, everybody hate Chris. Uh, regular show. Uh, 
kick Matowski fans or something like that. Disney, Nick, or Cartoon Network. Cartoon Network. Or Dust One. <laughs> Cartoon Network. Yeah. Dust One, that one, yeah, like two good shows. Yeah. 